Hey boys and girls, we are going to do a draw a rhyme story. So if you have a pencil and a paper, this will really help you out and we can go ahead and draw together. Uh, we're gonna use some clues to figure this out and what we're gonna be drawing today is a clown, but we're gonna have to figure out the rhyming words to know what to draw. So let's lose, use these clues and see if we can figure it out together, all right? <clears throat> it says, when making a clown, it is said, always start with his big round what do you think it is you're right it is the head so always start with a big round head <clears throat> make it real messy because clowns don't care on the top of his head give him red curly what do you think it's supposed to be you're right red curly hair some red curly hair on there. When people laugh, he wants to hear. So on each side, give him a great big, I'm thinking ear, is that what you're thinking? Ear. So here we go, these are his little ears. Okay, now make him look very wise by giving him two wide open, wide open what? Yeah, eyes. Those are pretty wide and open. Okay. And yes, of course, everyone knows. Give him a fat, big, rounded. What do clowns have that's big and fat and rounded that rhymes with nose? Actually, it is nose. All right. Now make a line as long as a mile and turn it into a great, big, Smile. Let's make a clown looking smile. I'm gonna outline mine just to make it really big. It's kind of silly looking. All right. Look at his clothes, the clown suit he's in. It has a ruffle right under his chin. Oh, I read that one to you, I'm sorry. But let's go ahead and do a ruffle under his chin. Do you know what a ruffle looks like? It's wavy like this. All right, I'll give you a second to do that. All over his suit are big colored spots. So give him lots of polka, yeah, polka dots. So let's go ahead and draw a suit for him. Let's see, I'll just make it like this. And you can make your suit however you want, but what do we have to put on it? Polka dots. So I'll draw some polka dots. Now look at that. Can you believe he has purple stripes on, stripes on each long, yeah, each long sleeve. And I don't have purple, but I'm gonna use blue because it's kind of close. So it says he has stripes on his sleeve. Okay. He has two hands, one left, one right. One's painted yellow and the other white. Well, I'm sorry guys, I do not have the right colors, but we can just use our imagination. So we're gonna do this one yellow. Let me read that again. He has two hands, one left, one right. One's painted yellow and the other was right. It is white. So we'll pretend, I'm gonna write yellow here, and I'll write white here so we know what color it's supposed to be. Okay, at the bottom of his funny suit, you can see one big black, what would be at the bottom of his suit? That's big and black, it rhymes with suit. It is a boot. So he has a big black boot. Okay, we're almost done. And the other foot has not a shoe because he painted his toenails. What well, rhymes with shoe and would be a color that he painted his toenails? Shoe and blue. So we'll draw his foot. Oh, that's a really big foot I drew. That's kind of silly looking. And we're gonna paint his toenails blue. 
Now, if you've listened and did everything right, your little clown is a funny sight. I agree, that clown looks pretty funny. And if you have the right colors, you can go back and color yours. I hope y'all enjoyed this.